We're looking back at 2019, a year to remember. More mass shootings, disgraced financier Jeffrey Epstein died in jail, and a widespread of college admission scams involving some Hollywood actresses. Well, CBS 4's Tom Hansen looks back at the top national stories of 2019. A massive college admission scandal dubbed Operation Varsity Blues ensnared dozens of wealthy parents, including Hollywood actresses Felicity Huffman and Lori Loughlin. Federal prosecutors charged them with paying mastermind Rick Singer to get their children into elite universities. For every student admitted through fraud, an honest, genuinely talented student was rejected. Amazon founder Jeff Bezos accused the publisher of the National Enquirer of trying to blackmail him with lewd photos and explicit text messages between the billionaire and a woman he was having an affair with. Around the same time, Bezos announced his separation from his wife Mackenzie. The divorce made his ex one of the richest women in the world. Wealthy financier Jeffrey Epstein was found dead in his New York City jail cell while he awaited trial on sex trafficking charges. The medical examiner ruled it a suicide. A federal court in New York convicted and sentenced Mexican drug lord Joaquin El Chapo Guzman to life in prison. Nearly three months after she disappeared, 13-year-old Jamie Kloss turned up alive in January after escaping from the man who kidnapped her and murdered her parents. A lawyer read her statement in court. He thought that he could own me, but he was wrong. I was smarter. Former Chicago police officer Jason Van Dyke was sentenced to more than six years in prison for killing Laquan McDonald in 2014. Dashcam video showed Van Dyke shooting the 17 year old more than a dozen times as he walked away from officers. During her sentencing, former Dallas police officer Amber Geiger hugged the brother of the man she was convicted of murdering. Geiger shot her neighbor Botham Jean in his own apartment. She claimed she thought it was her apartment and that he was a burglar. Second floor. 2019 saw more mass shootings across the U.S., including an attack inside a municipal building in Virginia Beach that left 12 dead. In August, two mass shootings less than a day apart at a Texas Walmart and an Ohio business district left 31 dead. Off the coast of Santa Barbara, a dive boat burst into flames, killing 34 people. Firefighters battled dozens of wildfires across California, including a massive one in Sonoma County that destroyed more than 100 homes and buildings and forced the evacuations of hundreds of thousands. The New England Patriots beat the LA Rams to win their sixth Super Bowl title, tying the Pittsburgh Steelers for the record. The U.S. women's national soccer team won its second World Cup in a row as it continued to advocate for equal pay. World champions! The Nationals won their first ever World Series. And Washington's National Zoo said goodbye to giant panda Bebe, who went to China to join a breeding program. Tom Hansen, CBS News.